Welcome warriors to the Office Gladiator page. Today we venture into the turbulent waters of job termination. It's an unnerving journey, one that's fraught with emotional upheaval. The storm that comes with being fired can be a whirlwind of emotions. It's a storm you might not have seen coming and when it hits, it can leave you feeling adrift in a sea of uncertainty. The first wave that often hits is shock. The news can feel like a bolt from the blue, leaving you stunned and disoriented. It's like a sudden gust of wind that knocks you off your feet. You might find yourself asking, is this really happening or why me? It's a natural reaction to unexpected change and it's okay to feel this way. Next, denial may creep in like a thick fog that obscures reality. You might find it hard to accept that you've lost your job. It can be easier to pretend it's all a bad dream, hoping to wake up to the familiar routine of your work life. But remember, it's okay to feel this. It's part of navigating through the storm. Then comes the anger, like a thunderstorm brewing in the distance. You might feel a sense of injustice, a burning resentment. You might ask, how could they do this to me? Anger is a natural response to feeling wronged. It's okay to feel angry. It's part of the storm. And finally, there may be sadness. Like a steady rain, it can seep into every corner of your life. The loss of a job is a significant life event. It's okay to grieve for what you've lost. It's okay to feel sadness. It's part of the storm. Remember, warriors, it's okay to feel these emotions. It's part of the process. The storm might be fierce, but it's not forever. Embrace the storm. Navigate through it. It's the first step towards calmer waters. Once the initial shock subsides, you might find yourself in the eye of the storm, where everything seems calm, yet uncertain. In the aftermath of a job loss, you're likely to find yourself in a stage of contemplation and reflection. This is a critical juncture, a quiet moment in the middle of the storm where you can catch your breath and regroup. It might feel unsettling, like the calm before another wave, but it's also an opportunity to gather your thoughts and reassess your situation. One of the first steps is understanding why you were let go. Was it due to company-wide layoffs or performance issues? or perhaps a mismatch of skills or cultural fit. Grasping the reasons behind your termination can provide valuable insights for your next steps. It's essential to approach this with an open mind, ready to learn from the experience instead of dwelling on the past. This moment of reflection can bring about a whirlwind of emotions. It's natural to feel fear and anxiety, especially when it comes to the future. Job loss can threaten our sense of stability and security but it's important not to let these feelings consume you. Instead, acknowledge them. Recognize that it's okay to be scared, but don't let it paralyze you. Channel your concerns into constructive action. Use this time to evaluate your strengths and weaknesses, to identify your passions and interests. If there were areas where you struggled in your previous job, consider seeking training or education to improve those skills. If your job wasn't fulfilling or aligned with your values, contemplate a career shift. Remember, this is a phase of introspection, of understanding, and of growth. It's not merely about finding another job, but about finding the right job, the one that aligns with your skills and aspirations. This period of calm in the eye of the storm can be a transformative experience if you let it. It can equip you with the self-awareness and resilience needed to navigate the job market and life's other storms with confidence and grace. Take this time to reflect and learn, but don't let fear paralyze you. You are a warrior, remember? Emerging from the storm can be a daunting task, but remember, every cloud has a silver lining. In the wake of a storm, there is always a sense of calm. It's the stage where acceptance settles in, like a soft blanket, comforting and warm. It's a crucial part of the journey. It's the moment when we realize that life as we know it is changing. And rather than resisting this change, we begin to embrace it. Yes, losing a job is a significant setback, but it's also an opportunity to reassess our path, to contemplate our desires, and to chart a new course. Acceptance isn't about forgetting the past or denying the pain. It's about acknowledging the situation and recognizing its impact on our lives. It's about understanding that it's okay to feel hurt, to grieve for what we've lost but it's also about knowing that it's essential to move forward, to not let this setback define us or our future. That's easier said than done, right? But when one door closes, another one opens. This is an opportunity to explore new avenues, to learn new skills, 
to challenge ourselves in ways we never thought possible. It's a chance to reinvent ourselves, to become the person we've always wanted to be. Being let go from a job can be a blessing in disguise. It can push us out of our comfort zone, prompting us to take risks, to strive for something better. It can lead us to discover passions we never knew we had, to meet people who inspire us to find purpose in unexpected places. Let's view this not as a loss, but as a gain, a gain of time, of freedom, of possibilities. It's a chance to grow, to evolve, to become stronger and wiser. This is not the end of our journey, but rather the beginning of a new one, a journey filled with hope, resilience, and determination. As we emerge from the storm, let's keep our heads high, our spirits unbroken, and our hearts full of courage. Because we are more than our jobs. We are warriors, capable of turning any setback into a comeback. Remember, warriors, every end is a new beginning. It's time to pick up the pieces and move forward. Now that you've weathered the storm, it's time to prepare for battle. Being fired is tough, no doubt about it. But it can also be a catalyst for change, a chance to forge a new path. So, let's talk about the practical steps you can take to plot your course and prepare for the next chapter of your career journey. First off, dust off that resume. It's time to give it a good polish. Update it with your most recent job and any new skills or experiences you've gained. Remember, your resume is a tool to market yourself, so make sure it paints a vivid picture of your capabilities and achievements. Don't be shy about showcasing your talents, but also keep it concise and to the point. Next, let's talk about networking. You know that old saying, it's not what you know, it's who you know? There's some truth to that. Reach out to your contacts. Let them know you're on the lookout for new opportunities. Attend industry events, join online forums, participate in webinars. These are all great ways to connect with potential employers and stay up to date with industry trends. Now, it's also a good time to explore new career paths. Maybe you've been considering a shift in your career direction. This could be the perfect time to take that leap. Research different industries, look into further education or certification, and consider what truly interests you. And finally, prepare for job interviews. Practice answering common interview questions. Research the companies you're interested in. Dress the part. Remember, first impressions count. So make sure you enter each interview with confidence, armed with knowledge about the company and clarity about your own career goals. Remember, warriors, preparation is key. Face every battle head on. It's through this preparation that you'll find your strength, your resilience, and ultimately your success. So gear up, step into the arena, and show the world what you're made of. We've navigated the storm together, warriors. Now it's time to put our knowledge into action. We've journeyed through the whirlwind of emotions that come with being fired from a job. We've learned to embrace the storm, to find calm in the eye of it, and to emerge stronger on the other side. We've prepared for the battle that lies ahead, equipped with the tools to turn what feels like an end into a fresh start. Remember, each challenge is an opportunity for growth, and being let go from a job is no exception. It's not a closed door, but an open window to new possibilities. Stay resilient, embrace change, and seize the opportunities that come your way. Remember, knowledge is power. Please like, share, subscribe, or follow the Office Gladiator page. Stay strong, warriors, and see you in the next battle.